When you start Revit, the program opens to the Recent Files window. While this window typically displays projects and families that you opened most recently, if this is the first time you've started Revit, the files shown are preloaded samples provided by Autodesk. If you have used an earlier version of Revit and want to open an existing project, click Open below Projects. Revit displays the Open dialog. You can use the tools in this dialog to navigate to the folder where the project file is saved, select the file, and then click Open. You can also use the Application menu. Click the large R in the upper left corner to display the Application menu. Then choose Open Project. Note that when you open a project that was created in an older version of Revit, you will see a dialog telling you that Revit has to upgrade the file to the latest file format. Depending on the size of the file, this can take some time. Once you save a project in a new version of Revit, you will no longer see this message, but also you will no longer be able to open the project in an older version of Revit. If you are working with others who are using an older release version of the software, this can pose a serious problem. In order to collaborate with other disciplines, while other project team members can use a different industry version of Revit, such as Revit Architecture, Revit Structure, or Revit MEP, all team members must be using the same release of Revit. Once you have saved a project file in Revit, the Recent Files window displays those projects and families that you have worked on most recently in descending chronological order. Revit displays thumbnails of these existing files to help you identify them. You can then open one of these files by simply clicking it. When you hold the cursor over an image, Revit displays a tooltip showing the path, file size, and date that the project or family was last modified. Of course, you can also still open any project file using the application menu.